So Perla stands for pupils are equal around, reactive to light and accommodation. So we're supposed to be looking at his pupils. This side should match the other side's pupil size. Okay, so we have a pin light here, right? It has two through nine uh, millimeters. One is able to compare this to the client's pupils and it should be the same on both sides. Whenever you go to measure your client's eyes, if it is four on this side, then it needs to be four on the other side. If one is dilated while the other is constricted, then that may be a sign of something's going on. It could be increased intracranial pressure or something is happening. The acronym was pupil. Pupils are equal, so that's in size, round as in shape, reactive to light. When I shine a light, do they react, right? Reactive to light, they should constrict whenever I shine a light, right? And then accommodation. So in terms of accommodation, we take our pen light from a far distance. Look straight ahead. Keep your eyes on the pen light. All right? And this is what should be happening whenever you do do it. If you notice, his eyes, we'll do it again, this one. they converged as in kind of cross, right, or came to the middle, right? And then if looking in at his pupils, they constricted, okay, so they got smaller. That is accommodation.